Hey everybody, this is Brett, and today I'm extremely excited to go over this brand new 2023 Jeep Wrangler four-door high tide in pumpkin metallic. This 2023 Jeep Wrangler four-door has the 3.6 liter Pentastar V6 engine, 285 horsepower, 260 foot-pounds of torque. This one's gonna get you 24 miles per gallon on the highway, 19 city for an average of 21 miles per gallon. I'm gonna go all the way around in this video. I'm gonna go over all the options that the high tide package gives you and uh, just show you the vehicle inside and out. If you like the video, remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. And uh, you'll get updates every time we do these videos of our new and used inventory. Starting off, the high tide package is based on the sport model. So it gives you a lot of stuff. It's an expensive package, but it gives you a lot of stuff. We'll start off with the front here. You get the LED headlamps, the LED running lights, the LED running lights and the fenders, as well as the LED fog lamps. That's part of the high tide package. You also get this gloss black border around the fog light bezel. And of course you get the seven slotted grill. This color is called pumpkin metallic. And just looking at it, you kind of think, boy, it doesn't really look very metallic and it's not very metallic. It's very, very light metallic. You can see it sparkle there. My phone's not even going to pick up on the sparkles because they are so faint, but there is just a slight metallic to it. So the other thing that the high tide package gives you is the 35 inch extreme recon tire and wheel group. So you get the um, eight inch beadlock capable wheels, uh, 17 by eight inch beadlock capable wheels, as well as the BF Goodrich all-terrain TA tires. These are LT31570 R17s, um, KO2s. You get a one inch uh, suspension lift with the sway bar links as well as the shocks. Now this is going to give you actually three and a half inches of height over between the wheels and the lift over a standard sport package. So good to know, I just went and measured a sport package and that one sits at 72 inches, this one sits at 75 and a half inches. You also get the extended fender flares to uh, accommodate for those wheels. And you also get the rock rails with the high tide package. Notice they've taken the unlimited away from the wording on the Wrangler four door here. You get the blacked out Jeep lettering and of course the high tide stickers on the hood look really good. You also get the sandals and the shroud there, as well as the Jeep climbing up the side, which you would normally always get. T50, that's how you take those doors off. We did a demo on how to take those doors off if you want to check that out. That's in the description below, as well as uh, in the upper right hand part of the screen. Here's the original window sticker. I'm gonna go over everything on here, well, most of it. Um, four door, high tide, and it's based on the sport package. Uh, you get the pumpkin metallic clear coat. 3.6 V6 and the eight speed automatic transmission. Everything on your left here is standard equipment. The pumpkin metallic clear coat is 695. The customer preferred package 25D or high tide package is 12,095 bucks. So uh, like I said, you get the extreme 35 inch tire package, the high tide logo, premium wrap steering wheel, windshield with Gorilla Glass, LT350 70R17 tires, the 17 by 8 inch beadlock capable wheels, the color matched hardtop. That's one thing that um, kind of gets hidden in this package, but you get the color match hardtop, which is a very expensive option on a normal um, Wrangler to get that. So Sunrider for hardtop by Mopar, that's going to be what's in the box in the back. Uh, LED headlamps and uh, the deep tinted windows, sunscreen windows, power heated mirrors, remote keyless entry, anti-spin, sun visors, freedom panel, rear window defrost, and wiper mold in color bumper with gloss black accents, all weather floor mats, and hinge gate reinforcement by Mopar. Uh, the other thing you know that the high tie package gives you, they kind of hide it right here, but the power heated mirrors, you also get the power locks and windows. Uh, so you'd have to step up to a Sport S package to get that as well. And I'll, I got it all broke down, so you can check that out in just a second. Technology group, uh, is 1095 bucks gives you the enter and go system with the passive entry and lock 
air conditioning with automatic temperature control and cluster with the 7 inch TFT color display. You also get the convenience group with remote start and universal garage door opener that's $9.95. 8.4 and premium audio group is $22.95. You get the um, 8.4 radio of course with the Alpine premium sound navigation system Sirius with six month radio subscription Sirius Guardian for a year Sirius travel link and travel traffic plus for five years as well as emergency and assistance call. Eight speed automatic transmission is 4200 bucks with that or 4250 I should say with the uh, eight speed automatic transmission the V6 and then the cold air intake by Mopar's 525. Total MSRP is 58940 on this Wrangler and uh, to get all your rebates and incentives on this Jeep in the upper right hand part of the screen as well as linked in the description below is a link to our website where you can get pricing and availability on this Jeep. I would estimate that this won't last long because of the color. I don't think they're going to be having pumpkin metallic next year. So this is probably a limited run color and it's going to go fast. 3 year 36 bumper to bumper, 5 year 60. There are your miles per gallon and your crash test ratings. So I broke down, I went on Jeep's website to figure out the high tide package and what you would have to spend to get everything that the high tide gives you. So you can see the Extreme Recon 35 inch tire group is a $39.95 option. The color match hardtop is $28.95. Anti-spin is $7.95. The LED headlamp and fog light group is $14.95. Sunrider top would be $8.95. The tinted windows, $4.95. I couldn't even find a price on the rock rails because, because those come standard with the Willis and the Rubicon packages. They, you can't really add them to anything, so there was really no price to them. I'm guessing like $300, $400. $400. Gorilla Glass windshields, $295. All weather floor mats, $170. And from the Sport to the Sport S to get the powers, windows, locks, and mirrors, you'd have to jump up uh, $2,665. So total improvements is right at 1370 or 13,700. Um, that's not including the rock rails. Uh, so you can see the high tides 1295, 137. Uh, if you were gonna do add all this stuff from the factory. So pretty good deal on the high tide package. Um, we'll finish our walk around here. So you also get with that 35 inch tire group you get the performance brakes as well another thing that they don't really mention you also get the tire reinforcement kit hinge gate and you also get these uh, uh, light extenders on here that they have to sit back farther because the tire sits back farther so you get these extenders and there's a little dog there Ralph for right right for Ralph and then on this side, there's Bulldog, and his name's Louie, or he says Louie, so left for Louie. Anyways, that's pretty cool. You get the backup camera extender as well. Get a good look at that tread pattern on the tire there. So back here, this is your Sunrider soft top. We did a demo on how to put that on. That's in the description below. You can take these hard top pieces off, three bolts on the side, two on the top, two quick disconnects. We got a video showing you how to do that as well. That's in the description below, as well as in the upper right hand part of the screen. You get all the color matched uh, bars in here. So when you do have that hard top off, everything is very well matched. There's your subwoofer. This is how they come from the factory. They got these styrofoam pieces in here to protect the sides from the box here. You also have your hard top case. And then you get these seven slots on the back door as well as the JL badge right there. So really nice. This would be probably, if I was in the position to do it, I would be, this would probably be the Wrangler I would get. So nicely loaded and um, looks really good. The lift, the wheels, tires, everything's just really nicely done. Inside you get the black cloth interior, get the bucket seats, uh, side curtain airbags on there as well, or side airbags, seat airbags, all weather floor mats, auto headlamps, power locks, power mirrors, power windows, the tilt, telescopic steering wheel. You can always see which one is has the Gorilla Glass because you get the little grill up there. And you get the seven inch LCD display. Get the Wrangler animation at the beginning there, uh, digital speedometer, as well as fuel economy, off-road, 
information. There's your digital speedometer. You get the leather wrapped steering wheel, cruise controls on the right, Bluetooth and information center controls on the left. You get the factory navigation system on here. Um, AM, FM, Sirius XM radio capabilities. And uh, you get all your different apps, including off-road pages, projection manager. Uh, the off-road pages, they take a second to load, so while they're loading here, I will show you that you get more tactile climate and volume and tune controls, start-stop capabilities, stability control, speed select crawl control. There are your off-road pages. You may be lost but never stuck. And then you get your steering angle, which is pretty cool. You turn that steering wheel, and the wheels will actually turn up there if you look really closely. As I turn that wheel, those wheels turn, um, as well as the angle there. Transfer case, you have your latitude, longitude, altitude. You also have your coolant, uh, all your different gauges there. And then pitch and roll. When you're outside, it can actually gauge if you're pitched down or up, which would be great for off-roading um, for sure. Anyways, I'll show you the backup camera here because that's really nice as well. They've made these HD crystal clear so that uh, you can see what's going on behind you better. Also note you get the mineral gray dash, which I like with the high tide package with the uh, sport package actually comes with that gray dash. Power windows, AUGS, USB, USB-C, 4x4 shifter. You get the 8-speed automatic transmission with the Jeep on there. Keyless entry with that remote start with the flipper key. Always like those flipper keys. Uh, they're really nice and chunky. So um, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to show you the Jeep. We'll do a final walk around with all the lights off in the picture studio. And then I will start it up and take a look under the hood as well because I've been told to do that. And uh, just give me one second here. What I'm going to do is I'm going to turn off all the lights in here so you can see just how nice and bright those lights are. All right, so you can see that uh, those lights are super bright. Um, I would highly recommend getting, if you're gonna get a Wrangler, make sure you get the LED light group. It's, uh, they're really, really bright um, and definitely an upgrade over the normal halogen ones. And boy, this thing looks really cool in here <laughs> when it's dark. Um, now the back lights are normal halogen lights. You also get the LED license plate lights on there. And uh, that's pretty much it. Like I said, we're gonna start it up here. So just uh, bear with me while I turn some of the lights back on in the studio here. But let's start it up and take a look under the hood as recommended by the viewers. Now I'm actually gonna be doing a test drive with this uh, vehicle on my personal channel so you can check that out at Brett's Auto Reviews. I would personally like to thank you for checking out the video today and hopefully from this HD video you've been able to verify the look, styling, options, and uh, everything with this Jeep. Hopefully answered any questions you had. Let me know if I didn't in the comments below. There's that cold air intake. Um, by Mopar. Once again, 285 horsepower, 260 foot-pounds of torque. There's the emissions sticker. 24 highway, 19 city for an average of 21. I'm also going to verify that in my test drive, so uh, definitely check out that video. And thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. And to see more pictures of this Jeep or one of our other 550 new and used cars, trucks, SUVs, minivans, Wranglers, you name it, we got it. Go to that website right there, summitauto.com, full pictures and descriptions of every single vehicle, all at summitauto.com. And if you'd like to check out more HD videos, you can go to youtube.com slash summitauto. Click the bell notifications, so you'll get updates on the videos I do each and every day here at Summit Automotive. In fact, in a second, you will see a link to subscribe to my YouTube channel in the upper left, a link to more Wrangler videos that I've done in the upper right, a link to how to take your doors off your JL Wrangler in the lower left, and a link to how to take your hard top off your JL Wrangler in the lower right. Click those, check us out, like, subscribe, and share, and we're super excited to help you with this brand new 2023 Jeep Wrangler High Tide Sport in pumpkin metallic clear coat. Thanks again for checking out the video. Remember to like, subscribe, and share on the YouTube channel. I really appreciate it. Thanks again.